Hi everyone, I'm Christina and I'm the Digital Content Specialist here at Yodec. And today I want to talk to you about a new feature which I really, really like. I'm very excited about it. I think a whole lot of you will be happy about it as well. Because now you don't need to create a whole new show in order to have content as default content for your monitors or in order to plug into a schedule. You can just pick a plain old media file, an image, a video, a playlist, and use that directly as default content or in your schedule. I'll show you how it's done. Here we are. We're on our Yodec dashboard. Click on Schedules, and we'll add a new schedule. Let's say it starts tomorrow at around 9 a.m. Now, as you can see, next to content, you always have the shows, as always. But if you click the little down arrow, you've got more options. You've got a plain playlist option and a standalone media option. So let's say we'll click on a playlist option. And let's say I've got a garden center, it's a small business, and I want to show my customers some quality content that promotes my products and the services I can offer. So let's click on gardening and landscaping. It's a plain old playlist, it's not a show. Click on that, it's already on fit, so it fits the screen. Okay, and let's say I wanted to finish at around noon, and I wanted to play daily, every day, save and there you go you can see we've got our playlist as a scheduled item and it's not a show you could do the same thing with images with anything you'd like with your business logo for downtimes just when customers come in and out now the last thing you need to do is name your schedule let's say garden center schedule and save it Pick a workspace, I'm picking my default workspace. And of course, you need to push everything to players in order for you to see all your changes on screen. Now, because I also want to show you how you can set regular media files as your default content for your monitor, let's do that first. So click on monitors. Here's my monitor. As you can see, I already have another schedule and my default content is now a show. We'll change it to a plain media file. Click on edit. And I'll pick for my schedule, my normal garden center schedule, which, which we just made with just a playlist, no show. And as default content here too, there's a little down arrow. Again, you can always select a show, but now you also have the option of clicking a playlist or a media and selecting that standalone playlist or standalone media as your default content for the monitors. Now remember your default content is what your monitor shows when there's nothing else scheduled. So we already have our schedule going. We also want some default content and I will pick plain old media file. And because I'm a small business, I'm going to choose my business logo just to have my branding there as customers come in and out. Here we go. Scroll down till you find what you want. Garden center business logo. It's set to fit so it fits in my whole screen. And I click OK. And there you go. Now you've got media as default content. And of course, always save. And as you can see, it's reflected immediately with your screen and your monitor. And always push to players. So any changes you make will be reflected on screen. And there you go. Now you can use media files, images, videos, playlists as your default content. You don't need to create shows. It gives you greater control. It's flexible and it's really easy to use. So I really hope you enjoy it. That's it for today. I'll see you guys soon.